Drag it. Now turn. You'll see. Hello fellow fellers and welcome to Fanzine and today I have for you some more Rocky IV Director's Cut news and information for you guys. Sylvester Sloan just put out a new Instagram post and with that new post he gave us uh, a new video of him editing and some information possibly about a theatrical release and some new music for Rocky IV. So let's start with his initial post in the video and go from there. I love re-editing this film. I have found such fantastic moments that I overlooked many years ago. This is a blessing to go back and get another chance to make it even better. My name, Drago. Cut to him. Mike Pataki stops and turns. Drago. And then he leaves. Okay? How cool is that? So he's, he turns when he hears Drago. Drago. No, you're late. He turns right here. Turns. Just. That's perfect. There. Drago. <laughs> Back to Drago. You still want to lose your. Not lose me. Lose me. I like that video of uh, Stallone editing that. It, it's pretty neat to see him like directing footage that's already been filmed, knowing you know he don't have these actors and can't tell these actors what to do or how he wants it. So he's basically telling the guy that's cutting the film together how he wants them to turn how, and what he wants to lose and what he wants to keep. And I just I find that really interesting. That's pretty neat. I like how he's doing this. Uh, so I I have to say that video is pretty interesting. As on to some of the other news. Could this possibly be a theatrical release before it is a digital or a physical media release? Well, uh, also in that Instagram post down in his comment section, Sloan posted this. I believe it's going to be released as a feature first. That's kind of interesting that this movie will possibly be uh, released in theaters before, uh, you know, like I said, uh, on digital or physical media. That'd be pretty cool to see his director's cut uh, in the theater. I'd be interested to see that. I wonder how they would go about it. I, it would probably be like a couple day event or something. Probably won't be like a huge theatrical run, but you know, special screenings, and then we'll get it released. And it'll probably be around November twenty seventh, which is the thirty fifth anniversary of Rocky Four. Um, as we continue on with this Instagram post, somebody also asked Stallone if there would be any new music for the film, and he responded with this: Yes. Two songs that were written for Rocky IV and never used will be included. So I guess fans of Sweetest Victory might get what they finally want and have this song in the film. Who knows? I would assume that is one of the songs Sweetest Victory because it's not in the movie but it's actually on the soundtrack. Uh, but who knows? We'll see uh, what those two songs are and uh, how this all plays out with the new music. Uh, I'm interested. I'm, I'm, I'm interested. I'm curious what those two music uh, songs were that were written at weren't in the film and uh, you know finally as we continue on into this post somebody asked Stallone what cut does he like better the theatrical cut or his new director's cut and he responded with this there will be no comparison the new cut is so soulful and the fight is so much more exciting it's hard to express my enthusiasm fully it's ten times better than the original this worries me a little bit because with theatrical and director cuts I'm cool with that you know I'm cool with that letting a director get a new cut of his film and as long as we have the theatrical cut and a lot of directors tend to like their director's cut better than the theatrical cut so there's you know that that's fine but I can't say one or other without seeing it first so I don't want to go too far ahead of myself but there are cases where uh, director cuts work uh, take for instance um, Nightbreed a lot of people consider the cabal cut the director's cut a lot better than the theatrical cut and a much better movie and the movie that was meant to be and then I've also heard that people do not like the cut of the movie Legend with Tom Cruise and Tim Curry uh, because the director's cut is changes the story and uh, people don't like the ending to that so they prefer the theatrical cut. So I will have to wait and see but uh, it looks it sounds to me like he's very thrilled and excited about this director's cut. I still 
we'll have to wait and see. <laughs> I don't want to say I don't want to say anything because it could be really really good or uh, the theatrical cut could be far uh, far and ahead of it. So we'll have to wait and see. But I am looking forward to this. And so let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Are you guys still excited for this cut? Did you guys like the video of Stallone editing and slash directing this clip with Drago in them? Uh, are you prepared for the two new songs? What do you think they're going to be? And we do you think this director's cut could be better than the theatrical cut? Let me know in the comments section down below because I do want to know your guys' thoughts on all this. And if you like this video, please give it a like. If you did not like this video, it's okay. You can go ahead and give it a dislike. That is up to you guys. No hard feelings here. Uh, share the video out for everybody to see. If you liked what you saw, please consider subscribing and hitting that bell for notifications. I would truly appreciate that. Wherever you are, have a great, safe, happy, healthy day, morning, afternoon, evening, and night. I thank you for watching, and Godspeed.